What am I doing now? We're going to have a shoe fashion show. Tamu shoes. Some of the shoes, I only got one shoe out, so you only get to have a half of the show. Okay, look at this one. It comes in different colors. I can't tell you what I paid, but I love the length of the heel. Height, I mean, not the length. These seem wider shoes. Wide as in not narrow. So, and then the green one is just like how it slips in and they feel about the same on. Okay, next. Here are some, these rubber shoes. Let's try them. Right now, these are like $3.98 or something, a pair. They're pretty comfy. I think they're a little long for me. I got sevens and I could have got smaller maybe. But they're very comfy and the, if you can't wear heels, these would be nice. Of course, you know when you stand up, are your feet different? Okay, now these are the gold ones that I bought recently. And I haven't worn them yet. I haven't worn a lot of these because it's been winter. Don't want to wear them in the snow. Okay. This goes around. This, this band here that goes around the back is not adjustable. But look how cute right here it is. They're not too high either. I like them. Okay. Now, this is really awkward, stupid fashion show for you. Here are these clear ones. So, this goes around somehow. No, this goes around this way, and this goes around this way. Okay. And these, I like these. See, if you were going on the cruise, just take this pair to wear with all the dresses and they would match everything. Of course, the gold would too. Tilly wants in, Tilly go away. I like them. Okay, now. So, I'm gonna be huffing and puffing, taking them off and bending over. I need a shoe man. Okay, tried those. Now, the red ones that I just got. Let's try these, because these are nice. Not too high. They're a real sensible shoe, but these come in other colors and they feel real substantial. But I don't know if they're very youthful. I'll wear them though. Now here's another pair of the rubber shoes, purple ones, and they were like really, really cheap. So I bought them just to test them out to see. They come in other colors. Oh, I think they're pretty cute. They feel good on. They're comfortable. Yes, if you can't wear heels, these will be nice. Because they look fancy. I'm surprised, that surprises me. Okay, I only brought one of these. The green, periodical or something green. I don't know what color it is, they told me. Somebody told me, but I still don't remember. And it's adjustable. And see, they're not too high either. They're pretty cute. Those are smashing, I love them. Those are cute. I'm gonna be wearing that polka dot dress. The black polka dots on this color dress, that's what they go with. I like them. Now this is the shoe 
I bought them in white, blue, and red because they were so cute. And I wore them to my son's wedding. Not these, the white ones. They're not very high and my sister asked, and oh, they're comfortable. And look, the bottoms are red, like if it was that one kind, Jimmy Choo or something, aren't they red bottoms? And they're very comfortable. And my sister said, do you care if I get some like those? I don't care one bit, please do. We could be matching, except I never see her. All right, I have a dress, polka, another polka dot dress, that these match it really well. They're all summer though, but I will be wearing them in the summer. I like them. They're very comfortable. And they're nice. I like how the heel is patent leather look. And then the rest of it is just like this. Cute, cute, cute. Now here's a red one. And these, <laughs> to me, these are a real flimsy shoe. They're not nice like these other ones, but they're real comfortable. And I bought them in black and the red because they were like $5. Don't know if they still have them. And this has that weird kind of buckle that I call them my Christmas shoes. Can't do it. Anyway, they're cute. I'll show you how this buckle works. I can't remember what, it's a dancing buckle or something. And it comes around here and then it just hooks onto this like that. Those are cute. All right, next. The blue ones, we'll try blue. because I bought the blue coat that matches these. So, oh, I like these a lot. Here's the shoe without being on, looks like. Does this tea strap look okay? Yeah, they're real comfy. I like them. Okay. And these, again, are called Latin dancing shoes. And they're real bendy here. So you know they have to be comfortable. And they're kind of a weird color. You would think that little hook is easy to put them on, but it's not. Okay, not putting on both. See, they bend real good so you can be a dancer. I used to do the Charleston. See if I can remember how to do it. And you did this, and then you went. Haven't done it in years. When I was a teenager, we had a dance festival. And then I went to Salt Lake, we had a dance festival and they taught us the dances. And the Charleston was my favorite. I love these new orange ones. <sighs> love them, they're comfortable. And I want, they have green ones. Now I can't get my shoe off. This stupid Latin buckle, dancer buckle. There, got it. These will be comfy. But see, the bottoms are kind of like fabric-y. It's weird. But, you know, I only wear them to short while. I'm not wearing them all day. But, oh, I love these. It needs to be tightened more. Aren't they cute? And they come in, like, silver, 
white, green. And here's my purple ones. I got my new purple dress to go with these. But these are the kind that don't adjust. The strap isn't adjustable, but they'll be cute. You're only getting a one shoe try on. And here's, see, look. Now, of course, these are more coral maybe because these orange ones, look how cute these are. <gasps> oh, how can I love so many shoes at once? I'm gonna have to go into therapy because I love shoes so much. They just make me happy. I love, this is the perfect height too for old ladies, not too high. All right, see if I was ambitious, I would have brought a dress out to match each one. Okay, here's my other brand new one. Tilly, go away. Scratching my door. <laughs> Love them. I think I have a hot pink dress that will go with them really good. I wore these to church last Sunday or the Sunday before. These gray. But I don't like how this strap right here is white. And this comes around and it has that hooky thing. But I liked them too. They were comfortable because the heel is fatter. All right. Now, I'll take this one off. I wonder how many pair I have here. I should count them. Then I'll know how much I spent. But if you, ad if you average $10 a pair, say, then I'm going to count them in the end and we're going to figure it out. $10 a pair, we're just going to run it off like that because that's about what I only want. A summer cheaper. And these, I'm disappointed because... They do, this doesn't stay up in the back, so I'm sad. But I bought those other strap things, but they don't have a six and a half. And I tried to stitch this in, but it's too low. So it just came off. So I'm not very happy with these. As cute as they are. Oh, and these. These might be a little too high for the grandma that I am. Tilly, if you scratch in my door, I'm gonna be mad. She likes to be too personable with me. And I'm not used to it. These don't feel that high. They're cute. And they're really comfortable because they kind of have a wedge. I mean, you know, if this is lifted. So they don't feel that high. And then let's try this one. This is when I typed in red shoes. Then they just kept bombarding me with red shoes. And they were like, this is like $5. These red and black ones, how can I resist it? That's like giving an alcoholic a free drink. I don't wanna buckle it. They look about the same height. So, I got to get me some red. Are these red on the bottom? No. Are these? No. I got to get me some more red dresses. No. I'm not getting any more dresses. It's funny how these straps are kind of like beige. Okay, we're almost done. These. These reminded me of a name brand but I hate them. Look at how this fishnet, see the sides have this fishnet stuff. I think I wanna cut it out because it doesn't fit tight and it makes it look stupid. So I might return them even. They feel weird. My toes don't even come to the end. They're very big. They're not true to size. 
Okay, and then I have these blue, uh, royal blue. Because, you know, I have light blue. Then the royal blue. Because I like to dress monochromatically. My daughters tell me that's old lady. If you dress monochromatically, all the same color. Oh, these are cute. Look how cute these are. I don't want to buckle them. I'm getting to the end here. Oh, these are cute. Yeah, this will kind of tighten around here and this will tighten. Oh, those are cute. All right, I think that was all of them. Okay, now we're going to count them. I need to vacuum my carpet down here too. Okay, I'm wearing shorts with my nylons. Okay. We're just gonna say they're ten dollars each. All right, ten, twenty, thirty, forty, fifty, sixty, seventy, eighty, ninety, a hundred. Okay, that was a hundred dollars. Now. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 200. And then there's three more. $230. Now, um, I beg your pardon, but I know some people who spend that on one pair of shoes, cowboy boots or a pair of boots. They spend that much. And I have two, uh, how many was that? 10 and 10, 23 pair for $230, give or take. But, you know, like these, these were like $3. But then, you know, maybe these were 11 So... Anyway, that's just a rough average, so I don't feel bad because, you know, you might think I have a lot of dresses, and a lot, and I do, I do, I will admit, I do have a lot, but the problem is I don't spend much on them, and so some people, I know Jamie's ex, I mean, dead wife, it wasn't an ex, she spent like, you know, $100 on a dress. I have never spent $100 on a dress, not even my wedding dress. So if you spend that much, I'm going to have to let Tilly in because she's going to scratch my wood door. And that's why I don't like animals. It's like another chore. You got to make them happy. I know you guys love animals. Tilly, did you scratch my door? Yes. Grandpa's going to be mad. Stop scratching my door. How do you get away from him? My next project, I'm going to show you my next project. See this mess and my window mess? Cleaning this up next, my next project. I'm hoping to have enough energy today to do it, but now that I tried on how many, how many, 23 pair of shoes, kind of tired. Anyway, all right. I don't though. I don't think I'm going to be linking them down below because it's going to be <laughs> too many. Just type in what color of shoe that you want, like red shoe purple shoe, whatever, and they'll come up. And if you want the high heel, oh, see, get out of my face. I don't like dogs licking my face. Where's, you've been licking your butt, and then you lick my face. That's wrong. So, I love her to death, but I love her to just be over there. I'll pet you if you just sit right here. <coughs> and I might be allergic to them. All right, I'm not mean to her, though. I'm very nice to her. And I take her out every two hours. And she's very nice. I love her. But next, <coughs> I have, <coughs> I just have a cough right here. I think I'm allergic. Oh, don't get in my face. Oh, she likes me. But yeah, Tilly. All right. Trevor goes, do you want her? I said, no, I don't. I don't want a dog or a cat or fish or anything. Okay. I have to get busy, so have a good day. Bye.